Hey, man, good to see you. Hey, I'm gonna be moving soon. So, man, I could really use your help. Oh man, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, I would love to do that for you. That'd be cool. Give me a call when you're uh, when you're able to, uh, you know, when you're re ready to do it. Oh well, that's great. I mean, I'm doing it this weekend. So could you be at my house at like, you know, five o'clock on Friday? Oh, like this Friday? Oh, man, I can't. Oh, you can't? No, I can't. But any other time, you give me a call. Does that remind you of anybody? Have you ever had to move somewhere? Did anybody help you? Right, those people that helped you, can you say thank you? Because it's so huge. Listen, when you when you have to focus on whether you can or can't do something, it's about a willingness. This is one of the biggest breakthroughs mentally, mindset-wise, that really started shaping things for me as a coach, is talking about willingness, people's willingness to do something, willingness to help. So as you're thinking about a goal that you have right now, or a breakthrough you're looking to make, or somewhere where you're stuck, I want you to think, how far are you willing to go to sacrifice for what you want? So how far are you willing to go to sacrifice for what you want? It's not a can or can't, like our moving uh, example. Like you can, you can do something, right? But are you willing to? So if it's a job that you're looking for, are you willing to go and talk to people who do the kind of work that you want to be doing and kind of getting their insight and learning from them? Or is that something you can't do because you're worried about how it'll appear? Focusing on can and can'ts will open up a huge door of insight to you to lead to the really powerful question, which is how much are you willing to sacrifice to go after what you want? What are some changes that you know you need to make in order to get to that breakthrough or get closer to that breakthrough? that you're just right now not willing to take on. And it's okay if you're not willing to take them on. It's totally okay. But that awareness that it's your willingness or lack of willingness to do something is what should calm you down a little bit. Because if you got things going on and you just don't have the space, the, 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 the freedom or the flexibility to do those things or go after or do take on those certain action steps, that's okay. The timing's off. But pay very close attention to what you're willing to and willing not to do when it comes to something you want. So keep those things in mind. Be patient with yourself. Be loving to yourself. Be kind to yourself. Be kind to others while you're at it. Be an overachiever. And know that to me, you matter. And to me, I appreciate you.